Hello, hello. Good morning. I hope you guys are doing well. Today is Monday, October 30th. Tomorrow is Halloween. I absolutely love Halloween. I cannot wait. Every year we kind of pick a theme and we decorate our house. Last year we did a circus theme. The year before we had a pirate ship, so we have a really fun time with it. This year we have an idea in mind, but we're not sure if it's going to work. So if it does, I will post pictures on Instagram, so make sure you're following me. But I am off work today. Today, like I said, is Monday, October 30th. My daughter has school. My husband is working. So his birthday is actually tomorrow. So I want to kind of look for a few last minute items for his birthday. He's so hard to buy for. I mean, he really doesn't want for anything. So I got him a couple gift cards and I want to look for some things today. So I thought I would take you guys along with me. I'm also going to take a stop in Dior. I want to kind of look at their earrings and yeah, we'll just, whatever I do today, I'll take you guys with me. Today I'm wearing shocker right Kendra Scott earrings I have this Balmain t-shirt on that I got from Farfetch and then I just have some uh, jeans on from these are frame jeans they have sneakers because these are so comfortable out of all of the sneakers I own these are so comfortable and then I think for my bag today I'm gonna probably take this guy right here my Chanel jumbo this fits so much so what I'll do let me share with you what I'm carrying in my bag and then I'll share with you a full uh, outfit view Really quick before I share what's in my bag, I think for sunglasses today, I'm going to take these babies right here, my Louis Vuitton sunglasses. I love these and you can subtly see the LV logo. I have contemplated getting the gold pair, but I'm like, I don't need them, but they're just so, so cute. Okay, here is my Chanel Jumbo and it just has a receipt in here at the moment, some loose change. Let's go ahead and pack it. I, of course, have my trusty Chanel flap key holder with my fob sticking out. Pop that in. You guys recall from my Tiffany and Co. unboxing, I picked up this little guy right here from Tiffany. And this is where I keep all of my credit cards, like my store credit cards. The only thing, the zipper is a little bit stiff, but I love the color. Lips today, I have this. This is just a little lip balm. I am, I have my mirror. This was a crazy purchase, but you better believe I am using it. And just look how lovely, just so, so pretty. So I have that and I keep it in the little dust bag. Then I have talked about these all the time, but these are these little Compete blister patches because I have been at the mall too many times where I've gotten a blister. So now I keep these with me. And then finally, I have my Hermes Pocket Kelly wallet. This is where I've been keeping cash. I just love the little opening. Um, I also have some credit cards in there too, but I just went to the ATM and I have a little bit of cash here that I'm just going to pop in. But see, it expands really nicely. Then I just close it like that, really pretty. And is that everything? I'm also gonna take some Perfume Baccarat Rouge 540, and you can see this bag fits so much. So that is everything I'm carrying in my trusty jumbo. Now this can get a little bit heavy, but it fits so much, so I just love it. So let me show you my full outfit. All right, here is the full look. I have my LV Sunnies, I have my Kendra Scott earrings, my Balmain t-shirt, my uh, jeans from cream, uh, my Veja sneakers, and then I added this trench coat. It's a little wrinkly. I actually tried to steam it, but I didn't do the best job, so I got it out of the closet because it's a little chilly today, and then I have my jumbo, so that is my casual outfit today. Okay, I tried really hard to get the wrinkles out of my coat. I still have a few, but it's going to have to do, so this is the final look today. I love you. I will see you later, honey. I love you. I will see you later. Bye-bye. We are going to get ready to go, you guys. 
The leaves just look absolutely beautiful. My daughter had a lacrosse tournament this weekend and the leaves were so gorgeous. They were red and orange and yellow. This is just my favorite time of year. Today is still going to be a tad warm, but tomorrow on Halloween I think it's going to be in the 50s, so it's definitely going to feel like fall. So anyway, we are going to get going. Again, I have my trusty jumbo with me. I have my Nature Valley granola bar. Not much changes. We will see what we're going to get into, um, but I will show you some of the leaves as we start driving. It is just so stunning, so beautiful. I love fall. just arrived at the mall. It's not quite open yet. We have about five minutes until it opens, but I plan to go in and maybe check out Sephora to see what they have in store. You know that the Sephora sale is going on now. If you're a Rouge member, you can save 20%. I placed my order online immediately on the 27th when the sale started and I hadn't shipped my order yet. So I'm hoping that I will get that soon so I can get that video out for you. I'm really really excited about the items that I picked up so as soon as I get those I will share with you but I want to see what else they have in store because sometimes different Sephora's have different things see if we can find anything else today and I'm just gonna look around I might go in Lululemon I might go in Kendra Scott uh, Sephora um, I don't know if I'll pop in Louie if I do I'll bring you guys with me you guys know that I had returned my other Louie bag and now I'm just waiting to see if there's a bag I really really like it just hasn't been anything I have been like head over heels in love with so I'm trying to just wait there's no reason to waste my money if I don't see anything so but sometimes I found that you end up finding things when you least expect it so we'll see but anyway the mall is opening up now so I am going to head in and we'll see what we can find you better turn up you better be there when I shake watch me rocking if I can't stop if I should fall just go ahead go and catch me baby have a little friend sitting next to me. I may or may not have been a little bit of a naughty girl and I bought a new handbag from YSL. I'm very, very excited about it and I'm not gonna make you guys wait. I am gonna share with you in today's video. So I'm gonna be doing an unboxing when I get home. I also have three other items I picked up. One item was for my husband and then two items were Lululemon that I picked up as well. But I am gonna share the handbag unboxing in today's video. I'm not gonna make you wait. So let's go ahead. Let's get going and when I get home, I'll share with you the new bag I got. Hello my friends, welcome back. I have a very exciting unboxing for you. I have a new Saint Laurent handbag that I picked up and I'm gonna share with you in this vlog. I know usually if I buy a handbag, I will make you guys wait, but I think you've kind of been through this journey long enough with me. You know that I recently unboxed a Louis Vuitton bag. I really, really loved it, but it ended up not working out, so I ended up returning it. And this bag, it's something I had been thinking about for a while, but today when I was there and I tried it on, it just kind of hit me that I wanted to add it to my collection. So I have this to share with you. Let me really quickly, before I get into it, I also went into 
Lululemon and I picked up two things. So since this is a shopping vlog, I just want to share with you what I did pick up. I've been obsessed with the Lululemon scuba hoodies and they have this new color. It's this beautiful lavender and this is more of a cropped version. I have a bunch of different colors, but I saw this purple and the guy said it was new and I thought, oh my gosh, I have to have that one. So love these. If you haven't tried these, they're so good. They really are. They're a little bit of an investment, but... I am more casual, so I just thought that this would be great for me. So really, really pretty lavender. And then another item I picked up is something that I actually wear to work out in. And I also wear it casual as well. And it's their, it's their Love Tank. And I have it in a size 6. And it is just this white, but it is a scoop neck, but there's nothing better than like a brand new white tank. So I have this, and like I said, I'll wear it to the gym with a sports bra underneath, or I will even wear it underneath my cardigans or tops. And you have to excuse me, I think I mentioned to you guys that I recently got a new camera, so forgive me, I'm still kind of figuring out how it works, the lighting and everything. I have the same lighting setup that I did before, but it still looks a little dark on the viewfinder, so forgive me if it's not quite right yet. I promise you I will eventually get it right, I just have to figure it out. So anyway, so I got these two things from Lululemon. I also got my husband a sweatshirt. His birthday is tomorrow on Halloween, and he had been looking for a new black sweatshirt, so I picked him um, that up as well. But you guys want to see the bag so let's get into it as I stated you know the whole story with the Louis Vuitton bag I returned it so I actually bought this directly from the boutique I went into Neiman Marcus and they didn't have the one I was looking for so I ended up going to the boutique but usually for situations like this I like to buy bags from department stores so I can get points but this is a special circumstance where I did not so here is the packaging receipt and I have to say I got it I met a new sales associate she was absolutely lovely I just talked to her we both have daughters I talked to her I was in there for a long long time and she was just lovely to work with so if you go into the St. Laurent store of course you're going to get a different level of customer service than you would if you go into a department store and everything's going to just be packaged so nicely okay here is the dust bag the bag I picked up is the bag I picked up is the da -da 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 medium envelope bag and the tag actually says that this is the medium envelope bag in green leather and it says gray BR so it's more of like a beige or a grayish I would say so it's not quite gray but I just fell in love with this color and usually I will gravitate more towards black bags, but I wanted something really, really different. Now, the, I did try on the bag that I thought about getting last year, which was the Nikki bag, and I will be honest, it came down to the Nikki bag and this one, but they didn't have the Nikki bag in this color, and this color is what I was really after. Now, when I tried the Nikki bag on, that was the one I felt was gonna be the most functional because it had a back pocket, it had a front pocket, but the color, even though it was a beautiful caramel color. I do already have a YSL camera bag in that color and then I do have a Marc Jacobs tote. This, I do not have a bag in this color and you know how much I love the envelope bag. I own it in the large size but I wanted the medium size because this is a bag you can wear crossbody and it also does have a back pocket as well and then you open it up and this is so like nicely packaged so I have to take like all the stuffing and everything out of it but you can see the interior is just like one large compartment but this has the shiny hardware again you can see the back and I love this leather, even though it's a little stiff. If you want durable leather, this leather from YSL is probably some of the most durable out of all the bags I have. Like even the Chanel flat bag in caviar, that's what I had on today, that's durable, but this is even more durable. But it's something about the envelope bag. Now, I will tell you, and let me kind of take the plastic off while I'm talking, but I will tell you I was a little on the fence because I thought, well, I do have a little more of a ca casual lifestyle now and the envelope bag can have a tendency to be a bit dressy. But I have always thought that about my other one because it is so large and I couldn't wear it crossbody. But this one, because I can wear it crossbody, I tried it on with my 
trench coat and I thought it actually paired nicely with the trench coat and I will put a picture up on the screen. I don't have them to show you, but I thought, you know, if I had some nice sneakers that would match, you know, maybe I could kind of pull it together. So you know how much I love Veja sneakers. I have tried Golden Goose. They're just not comfortable for me, but the Veja sneakers are so comfortable. I had those on today and I didn't get any blisters. So I ordered Veja sneakers to go with this. I thought it was a good pairing. And again, this color is just so unique. Out of all my handbags, I don't have it and I don't have this color. And I wanted to do something different. This bag is so durable. I think I'm going to really enjoy it. The only thing, like I said, I was a little on the fence about is because the chain is like the shiny gold. I worry that it might be a little dressy, but I totally think that, you know, I can pull it off with like a trench coat and the sneakers wearing it crossbody. But I'm really excited because you know how much I love the back pocket. I would love to know your thoughts. Were you surprised? By this one I think I've expressed my love for the envelope bag over and over and this one is a little different to my collection not only in the color but also the size I do have the large one but that one kind of is more of like a shoulder bag this one I can definitely wear as a shoulder or a crossbody bag really really great so as I use it I will do videos I'll do what's in my bags I'll do a review and everything but I would love to know your thoughts were you surprised by this are you not surprised I think a lot of you might be surprised by the color because it's definitely something I wouldn't typically go for but I really want to branch out and get colors that I don't have and I think this is a bag I'm really going to gravitate towards quite a bit hopefully so we'll see so anyway thank you guys so much for watching if you're new to my channel I would love to have you hit that little subscribe button and I think I mentioned to you guys I got a shipping alert for my Sephora order so hopefully I can get that tomorrow and I can film that video and get that up for you so you can see what I picked up from the sale I have been quite a naughty girl lately but in my defense for the bag I did end up returning the Louis Vuitton, so this is kind of like a one-for-one one switcheroo, and they were around the same price, so. so I'm super, super excited about it. Have a wonderful day, you guys, and I'll see you in my next video.